guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting and getting to episode 7 of Gushing Over Magical Girls. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. What the hell about happening today? Oh, she pretty! Uh-oh, damn. She got an ass beat. <laughs> A magical girl never retreats! So, how are we feeling today? Also, because of course, it's today's the day. Happy Valentine's Day! Or, you know, how some people, us uh, single people, it's either Happy Fuck Love Day or Happy Self Love Day. I, I literally, so yesterday, I, um, over the weekend, I ordered edible arrangements for me and my mom and such because I was like I'm gonna treat my mom and I'm gonna treat myself towards it and such hell I also bought myself a ring on Pandora but really from a third party and such and it was hell trying to get this thing and then long story short in the end I'm getting two my other one's coming Friday and so I woke up and my mom called me and my mom got me flowers and perfume so happy Valentine's Day me so, I hope you are also having a good day. Even if it's not, like, you don't have anyone, just remember, self-love is the best fucking love. Go get drunk tonight if, if you are of age. If you are of age. If you are around my age, go ahead, clink, clink. I'll be there with you in spirit. I'm going to try to play Persona 3, even though you can't technically see right now. I'm kind of watching a stream at the same time and such, even though I got on mute. Um... But your girl has not played P3 Reloaded in, like, two weeks. I already have Fuka, but, you know, I, I still need to get Mysteru. And Mysteru is the best girl, so gotta get that done! <laughs> not the best girl. The best girl! She used to say this. Yeah, you know, she kind of gives me Yukari vibes. Is that me? Not the armpits again. Right? Because, you know, I feel like sometimes she'd just be like, fuck it, you know, mm -mm, give it to me. Girl, I know it's Valentine's Day, and sometimes we feel a little desperate and such, but no. It's okay. I mean, you, mm, you're not the weakest link, baby. You just, you, you get distracted. Hey, okay. I'm not trying to be mean, but her slumps, her slumps have caused y'all, like, how many losses? Jesus. 
but I do feel for her. Yeah, I don't think she wants to overtrude and, you know, overstep her boundaries. No, baby is sleepy. Look at her. Take her home. You're just horny, baby. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, that's kind of nightmare fuel right there. Now, I don't know why, but, like, in that moment, once again, I'm about to compare it to a show that has spoilers, but I'm trying not to spoil it. Remember that one moment of Magical Girl Raising Project where... Hit cut the cord! Yeah! Yeah! I'm trying not to cry. Oh, my God. My baby. Once again, just go watch Magical Girl Raising Project. Yes! Yes! Go watch it. If you like Madoka, go watch that. If you like Dog and Ropa, go watch it. If you like Dev Games in general, go watch it. It's good. Super underrated. Right? So don't think that you don't have potential, Sayo. You're really good. Once again, you, you just got distracted. Like I said, you know, Yukiko. I mean, you know, you, you, you like, Haruka could be like your, no, Utsuna could be your Chie. And you're just distracted by your Chie. And that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Yeah, go on vacation, go relax at an inn, or just onsen, or something. Get some really good sleep. Go read, you know, go get a, go read a good, uh, smutty book. <laughs> some good behind smut. You'll be okay. <laughs> I'm about to say, go drink, but you can't drink because you're a child. So, you know, go drink some water. Do you want a rose toy? I mean, because... <laughs> That's how it starts. You get the rose toy and then... <laughs> no, 
stuck on to my own horn. <laughs> Yeah, and, you know, now you're in battles with them and stuff, yeah. I really wouldn't consider them your friends just yet. I mean, I just consider them, you know, like your submissive bitches. Okay, walk, yeah, that's good. Go shopping, yes, yes. You gonna go take a nap? Nap sure got I, I need me a goddamn nap. No. Yeah, just trying to get her mind off of dirty, horny thoughts. Hmm? You want to go? me if I ever go to a pretty care exhibition. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye to me and all my fucking money. <laughs> that or they did like one for persona. Major goodbye. <laughs>
Just like that. <laughs> It is, but, you know, people still can see themselves inside of a magical girl. That sounded wrong the way I worded that. Like, they see themselves as a magical girl. There you go. There you go. There you go. Pretend I didn't say what I just said. Yeah, well, you know, one of them's on vacation, you know, the other one probably asleep. Bedtime, you know? So, you know, there's one on one solo. Not the force field. Come, girl, come on. You think that's really going to help? Baby, you say that, but next thing you know, Miss Little Baby gonna be riled up in a couple of minutes. If only she did <laughs> the fucking victory pose. <laughs> Oh, we'll see about that, babe. Not the ball gag as a panda. Not the panda, but... Um, that's not good. Oh, I thought she was about to lick her shoe. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs>
no, 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 no. You're fine, fine. Right? Oh, we're finally meeting the rest of these characters, thank God. Not the nun with the underboob. Okay, number one. What the absolute. The fact is that her freaking, like, the brooch, it broke. I mean, that's her signifying, like, yeah, I can't. <laughs> Break me. <laughs> There, okay, how can I, mm, how can I say this without, I mean, I've said worse things regarding with this show, and it's not, not like in bad sense of saying the show in the, is like, ish. It's more, okay, so, mm, okay, I can't say this for my guys, but, you know, for my girls, you know, when you be reading that really, mm, that juicy good behind my or you end up listening to a really good it is not safe at work it is some more and such and it just like <laughs> and, and it just mm, it breaks you it degrades you, and you just, like, you know, that brings out a side that you never thought you knew about yourself, and you be like, damn. Damn. Like, I enjoy this. And so it's worse, you know, when you are... <sighs> Headphones! <laughs> I just, you know, it's just, it's, it's, mm, uh, and, Addiction, yeah, it surely is. If you're not obsessive on certain things, yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> but no, truly, because that's what it feels like in the moment for her. Like just being, uh, literally, her for the last first half of this show for Sayo, literally being like, I'm not into this, but slowly but surely falling for it, being into something like that, and then going, that last little pivotal moment that broke her core, aka her brooch, and stuff, and Baby is all full in, like, yes, I really just, she wants to be dominated by her, and such, but even Utsuna in that moment is being like, hold up, you wanna go, you wanna stoop to this fucking level, and, you know, D and, uh, mm, re announce there, there's words that I'm like, the announce or re announce is, is kind of really the same, thing, the same thing. Like, your term of you being a magical girl and, and stooping so freaking low to this. Like, girl, I, I mean, I, I wasn't expecting her to lick some freaking uh, shoe. With, I mean, because you know, when I was, uh, no, it's like this. When I was getting ready to watch this episode, and I was making it into a file, and I was just looking through, because every single week I always look through to see, like, if I am watching the uncensored version and stuff. I have to always check, just in case. And so when I was going through, like, the little previews, and there's this moment where, like, of course, she's about to, like, literally lick her shoe, I'm like, where are we going with this? I, I mean, we really, we really going Fifty Shades of Grey, you know, BDSM up in this bitch and stuff. I mean, mm -hmm. once again, you know, yeah, mm-hmm. Anime, anime, <laughs> anime. <laughs> Showing your kinks and everything else since day one. You'd be like, yeah, I I'm not into that. And the next thing you know, you're into that. And yeah, you, you don't want to know what my, like, the, the smut that I read. You don't want to know. No. <laughs> like, I don't read, like, you know the shit from last week's episode? I don't do shit like that. No. No, 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 God, no, uh, 
that was a, what the absolute fuck was that? But, um, no, I feel bad for her in that moment. Even Utsuna, like, telling her off, you, you understand why Utsuna said it, and you cheer for the fact that Utsuna said it at the same time when you're looking at both sides. You're like, damn. But the other girls who we finally get to see, they all look badass as fuck, and I'm a little scared about what the hell about to happen in the second half of the show. I feel like now, because these four now have been introduced to us, this is when we're really, like, they're going to, okay, I'll say this. Let's use it as volume-wise. Right now, from the from episode one to episode seven, we've been at a measly little 50%. With these four bitches, we about to turn this to, like, fucking a hundred, maybe even a thousand. Like, these girls, I feel like, are top tier. Whatever the heck they about to do to these girls next week, I'm a little terrified. Like, it's like, you know, we ready for this? I'm a little afraid. Because, I, I mean, what the fuck these bitches about to do? Like, seriously. That's like, you know, when someone, okay, your, your significant other, whoever, yeah, because we're, you know, in the spirit of Valentine's Day, wants to try something new, and you're just like, I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that! <laughs> so you're just like, hmm, time to batter in my lungs right now. I don't know. Is this okay? Should we really do this? Or, um... You you go out and let's say you're you're looking for something. If you root my lips, there you go. Um, and you try it out, or literally no. Okay, let's say let's say you're at work and someone's returning something. Um, and she was giving it to one of her girlfriends as like a gift, but she already had one and it was on open and everything. And she's like, Oh, okay. And I was like, Oh my God, you want I, I want it. I, I've been wanting one so, for such a long time. And she's like, here, you take it. I don't have to return it free. And I was like, Oh my God. Thank you. Yeah. Um, but then, okay. So you're talking to your girlfriends about it. And I was like, yeah. So, you know, and such. And, you're super duper skeptical and, and like fucking scared about this thing because you know you heard things about this on TikTok and being like or not even TikTok also freaking like Twitter and everywhere else and be like you know once you try this out like say goodbye to getting a significant other and so you're super duper scared about uh, I mean fucking I've already said it rose toy um and such and then let's say you know you try it out uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm not saying nothing else and such. That's all I'm really gonna say. But yeah, think about, like, something about trying something new and you really like it and such. That's what we're kind of getting in with these four new girls. Anything could literally happen with the remainder of the episodes that we do have left. How many more episodes we got left before we're done with the show? I really don't know. Um, but I, I'm truly scared. Hell, I'm kind of scared for Utsuna, Kiwi, and Alice because they're the new girls on the block. And, you know, <laughs> one of these bitches is over here saying they're weak. Are the villains going to be fighting the villains? Oh, my God. What's going on, Joe? But other than that, guys, I did not really want to make this video that fucking long. 30 minutes, DJ. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is my reaction to be towards episode 7 of Gushing Over Magical Girls. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every day. Join the Magical Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys all officially next Wednesday for episode 8. Once again, happy Valentine's Day. Go ahead and get drunk for me. I'm probably going to get tipsy tonight while playing P3 um, and such. Enjoy the rest of the day. You know, hey, relax. You know, even if you got to go to work tomorrow. Not me, though. Um, you deserve it. E same thing with this weekend. Even if you ain't got to work this weekend, enjoy your weekend. Enjoy just anything. Have that time to yourself. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.